Howling Descent. I thought, you know, I thought these were supposed to be like Brave Hero stories were thought thought they were supposed to be paralogues, but no, they're just actual stories now. Passion's Madness. Here we go. I'll cut my own path. Go, Gullenbursty. Trample them under your iron hooves. Return the people to the ground they so cherish. <laughs> I kind of like how Fafner's like like that. I really like evil characters in this game to just be evil. Don't have very much character development because IS isn't going to do it right. Just be evil. Kill people. Destroy things. You know, be evil. So I'm liking Fafner thus far, even though I feel like he's been kind of silly as a villain. No mercy. Wait, what? Spare no one. My brother demands all tremble before him and perish. Ha 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 ha. Odor is kind of like a silly sidekick villain. <laughs> it's so weird. To, if he wasn't if he wasn't such a brocon, I think I would like him a bit more. What is he doing here? Why attack out nowhere like this? Veronica, I have no idea. I mean, I tried explaining this last time. I think it's really silly to attack Asgar and then attack Emblia. Because if you couldn't even take over Asgar, even though you got all the way to the castle and you were even captured. Your, your forces are definitely not in a good position. And Embla hasn't fought since what? Since, since, uh, Muspel? So they've had a lot of time to recoup. Unlike Asgar, which has been constantly in war, at war. So I don't know. If you can't even beat Asgar at this point, why do you expect to beat Embla? I, the plot doesn't really make sense to me when it comes to enemy forces. And obviously, like, Veronica still has her gates and whatnot and can sign contracts with other heroes. Veronica, what the? How are you here? Wasn't the last chapter Bruno with us in like? Yeah, w weren't we in like the other realm? In Nevelier? How the heck is he? First of all, this man could find us in Nevelier somehow so quickly. And second of all, the next chapter, he's in Embla. And he just found. How how are you how are you so good at traveling and just finding people? Brother, you've you've come back. I've brought you reinforcements, Alfonso's companions. That's um I, I wouldn't count that as reinforcements. <laughs> I think that's just a, a bench warmer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Guys. Um See, I'm not the only one who feels that way. Veronica feels that way too. Oh, just them. <laughs> wow, and after we've come to help you and everything. Uh, well, I'm sorry. Have you looked yourselves in the meta? Nobody uses you guys anymore. Only un unless we're forced to, I guess, in Arena. What is the situation on the field, Princess Veronica? Uh, I don't think Veronica's a good commander, so... Yeah. Probably not good. See for yourself. It's not looking good. He has strange soldiers at his command, and we can't compete. I'm surprised. Don't you have your own heroes? What happened to Xander? Didn't Xander and... Uh... Didn't Xander and... Your brother go on a canoe, and you sailed off to the middle of... Whatever happened to that plot... Did only one man come back? Was the canoe trip just an excuse... For Bruno to kill Xander. You've been getting too close to my sister. What? I thought I thought we were going fishing. No. No. You see, I didn't bring fish bait. So I guess you could say we're going fishing. And then Bruno stabs Xander and throws him overboard. Man. That's probably what happened. That's why Xander isn't here anymore. Well, that's unfortunate though. I think Xander's a pretty good commander. Especially in comparison to Veronica. Well... And as for Fafner himself, he must be some kind of monster. Ow, we beat him up and then captured him. And he has headaches. What happened to the head and whatever? It seems he has regained his strength then. Yeah, that was fast. For now, all we can do is try to force their withdrawal from Embla. Why don't we just kill him the first time around? Oh yeah, because Regan doesn't want us to do that. Yeah, yeah. Alright, here we go. Mars! I will go. You little piece of shit. I'm ready for this. Marth on Marth of violence. The best kind of violence. This way? Alright, we'll also have Zane up. 
Yeah, I'll sub Zeno. I must be careful. Sometimes I wish characters just wouldn't be so difficult. Sometimes you just gotta let us kill them. <laughs> uh oh, I didn't check. Oh, it's panic. Oh, that's fine. Wait, Marth might destroy my buttocks. Nah, Marth can't beat Marth. Wait a second. A brilliant thought. Fuck. I just realized I really messed this up. I don't have attack speed solo, and I don't. And he's gonna self buff himself, and it's gonna be pretty quick. That's even. That's even. Um. That's even. Tempest. So he doesn't. He's not. All right. Let's just see. Yep. I figured. I figured he, he, he's so stupidly quick. Yep, that's why I was like, wait a second, I need to move Zane, but I couldn't move Zane. Well, this is awkward. We gotta restart already. Because if I move Zane, my Edelgard would be in guard range and she'd be the one fighting. So I got put in a really awkward position immediately. Let's pretend that never happened. At least you guys now know that um, Marth is super good at killing Marth. <laughs> Though I think a lot of people already figured that out pretty quickly. Uh, yeah, let's do it. I smell sweet. I wonder. This way. I don't even know what I'm doing. That didn't even make any sense. Whatever. Surely you have no speed now. Yeah, draw. It's okay if it draws. Okay, that's awkward. Tread carefully. There you go. It's not Marth's fault. It's just the new Marth is so stupidly good. I feel it's really unfortunate how many people like have been underplaying his abilities. He's amazing. He's really amazing. I think the new Marth is just so stupidly good. I smell sweets. Boo. Nims formally dethroning young Marth. I mean, a brilliant first of all, why are you referring to me with my human name? And careful. second of all, uh, yeah, uh, uh, there you go. And second of all, it's not young Marth's fault. This new Marth is so good. New Marth, I think, is one of the best characters in the entire game, especially as a hero to commit to. Sigma Sensei, I'm not going to remark on him. His opinions sometimes are a bit wacky, and I'm not going to be the guy who's going to do that. But yeah, I'm glad he can admit that much. I feel like a lot of people as like certain conquerors have really underplayed how good um Brave Marth is. That's alright. That's nothing new. Ah. Alright, Steam, Marianne, Odor, Steam Sword, and Red Mage. Okay. I will go. Heh. <laughs> There you are, Summoner. Oh, we're doing this again. <laughs> How predictable of you. Yeah, I mean, the story progression is pretty linear, huh? Now let's not mince words. Die. This land will be ours. Oh, okay. I like how, you know, I, I think, I think Odor's, Odor's like a really good employee, you know? Like, even though he's gotten his ass beat, he always approaches his tasks with his utmost heart, right? Like, he's all in, all for the company, right? Like, all for... Oni Chan. Uh, um, so it's just, you know, I completely get it. Like, it's it's good attitude to have. Like, no matter how many times you get beat, believe you're going to win. That's the winning attitude. Hoder, listen to me. We've just come back from the Tower of Nivalier. There's something I must ask you. So Regan and Odor are actually like blood siblings. So they have the same. They're actually truly siblings. Fafnir is an adopted sibling, I guess. Like a step. Uh, I don't think a step. But like an, a, a brother in a non- blood sense but yeah if Regan is in fact a nevalier royal that means odor is a nevalier royal which means this is really weird because that means Regan and odor should be like the rightful um hairs to nevalier and obviously that means they should get married and have kids 
like Alphonse and Sharina. And there's nothing wrong with anything I just said. What? Did you go inside? Yeah, obviously she went inside. We did. And after what we learned, I've been thinking that maybe Fafnir isn't from Nevelier after all. Yeah, he, he probably isn't. My theory. I mean, I think you guys who already played already know what happened. But my theory going into this was that he's Alphonse's long lost brother and Henriette's his mother. And they were just separated at birth, you know. Or something like that. <laughs> or did you know that already, Odor? Yes, things are just as you say. Yeah, of course you knew. And now that you know that, all the more reason for me to end your lives here and now. Well, good luck doing that. I'm not gonna let you beat best girl. Well, second best girl. I think Fjorm's best girl. <laughs> Odor, wait. What were you and Itri planning? I need to know. Is there some connection to Fafner's true origins? Isn't it too early for you to find out that, Al Alphonse? I don't think you can handle it. That is my concern, and mine alone. You lot, always prying, digging into others' affairs. I'll show you where you belong, beneath my heel. But aren't you like three feet tall? I think Alphonse is even taller than you, and that's not gonna really happen. <laughs> Just saying. Please, goddess, lend me the courage I need. Well, goddess should help you with something, considering you're not as good as everyone had hoped. I still think she's good. I just think she's hard for most people to accept as a hero. Na -na 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 -na. No rallies? I thought one of them was for sure going to have a rally to show off her skills. Ah, don't look down. Don't look down. Bad for posture and makes me look dumb. Uh, I think here. Without question. I think here. Do I want to fight? She is really fast and just huge damage reduction. Don't fight her. I wonder. It would be a bad idea. I will go. And you have Bullman, and you have attack down, but you have only 35 speed. This Should way? be good. I don't see any traps. Sometimes I wish I had Times Pulse on this Marth as well, but I think it's overkill. Man, that music's still amazing. No mercy. On fire! No. What did you think was going to happen? Silly. Get 69! Hmm. No mercy. 98. Uh, no, no, no. I smell sweet. Ah, that's bad. Wait. The choice is clear. You can just stab her. A brilliant thought. Oh, that was easy. Yeah, the unfortunate thing about Marianne is she has like no defense value. She's a really interesting character with like a lot of offensive potential as well. But I, I feel like I feel like most people aren't gonna use her correctly, unfortunately. I feel like she fits in certain teams super well. And she's a really impressive character when you think about it. Her potential is immense. Her ability to help you control the battle is just so good. But she's not the easiest character to use, and for most people, it just wouldn't be as approachable as other characters. Damn it. I have to retreat. I'll pull back and regroup with Fafnir. What did you think? Odor, we've been doing this for how many months? Eight months? You've been doing a lot of retreating. Come on, man. You already know what's up. <laughs> Where have you gotten to, brother? Wait, weren't you just to get... Man. How are they so good at, like, invading places if they have, like, no communication at all? How does even Nevelier army even work? Ledger store. Without question. I learned how to wield a spear from my brother, which is funny because you're way better than your brother. No, do you guys agree with that? I think she is. I think she's like way, 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 way better than all the Ephraims combined. I also just don't think much of Ephraim. <laughs> maybe, maybe Ledger Ephraim update will be really cool, but I highly doubt it. So when she says she learned how to like wield the spear from brother, it's just silly, right? Because uh, technically she's like way better. I know she's effective against armor, but I'm still want to like tank it. Or yeah. 
That needs to stop looking down. Bad habits. Tread carefully. Tread carefully. Bad habits. I must be careful. Don't die. Or no, they die hard. I smell sweets. There you go. All right, here we go. Ledger Ephraim was good at back in the day. I mean, I thought he was pretty cool. And he was like one of the first heroes to get like a unique animation, which was awesome. Yeah, 25 times two. I won't back down. Boom. Boom. You you kinda have to you're underestimating my Brave Edo Guard's damage output bonfire. Edo's pretty good, man. Without question. This is not in range. All right. Ah. There it is. Yeah. Let's just let Zane take another fight. Ah. Don't look up. Don't look down. Look up. so bad i feel like if i just use like really merge heroes it wouldn't be so bad even though they're like kind of old at this point nothing to report oh no it is time gatekeeper can you guys imagine gatekeeper fighting on the side of nevalier that's just such a weird thought oh my, he's literally blocking out the map i have no idea what we're deploying into gatekeeper has screened the map he's gonna screen everybody else because we can't get past him but he literally screens the map as well no matter where I'm stationed, my only concern is protecting the gate. Is that why you took the gate with you? <laughs> oh, I'll look down again. Oh, no. Need to get used to not looking down. Trilemma. non care attack status. That's annoying. Nyah, 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 nyah. Marianne's also there. That's alright. We can start the battle pretty easily by putting Edogar on side. I smell sweets. Alright, well, that's gonna be our first turn. Let's see. Let's see, Gatekeeper. Ah, look down. Close reversal, detail report, joint drive, defense, charging horn. Yeah. He has a lot of defense. He's like he's like such a great min-maxed um mage. I think I don't know. Do you guys want him to be a Lancer? Or did you like prefer him as a green mage? I think its entire concept has been pretty cool. Damn, zero times zero times four. That's the real Owen. Owen doesn't actually do zero times four. You guys are horrible people for thinking she does it zero times four. Ugh. I must be careful. This way. Do I get the kill here? Uh, there's. Oh, what? I can actually kill Zane. Oh, I cannot kill Marianne. This way. Yeah, wow. I'm actually really impressed that we can, in fact, do that. Yeah, okay. Well, we're going to do that then. I smell sweets. Or I could place myself here and let Adogar teleport, which is also a really cool feature that she has. Yeah, this is the only hero we don't really have to worry about is... um. Okay, let's do it. I thought Gatekeeper would be able to take the damage, but Gatekeeper actually doesn't do a lot for himself. You know, attack res minus six on your opponent is not really a big, big deal. Oh, that's so cool still. <laughs> but he's a really good hero for controlling the field, right? Controlling the movement of enemy teams and whatnot. Like, yeah, he's still a good character. I must be careful. Marianne, gone. The choice is clear. I wish he negated his save skills. I think it's too early. Do you guys think that's going to happen? I definitely think like negating save skills oh, is uh is the future, but not anytime soon. I will protect the land. Boom. Because it, it it would it's not even been a year of save skills. Actually, has it been a year of save skills? I don't know, man. I 
Maybe? Uh, I don't know. But it, it feels like it would take like at least two years before they try like killing safe skills off. Fafner. Welcome back, King Fafner. Oh, man. You know, I usually like am terrified of big boobs. They terrify me because I don't want to suffocate. But Loki's still really attractive. Even though she... Those boobs aren't real, by the way. Man. Does it matter to you guys if it's if they're real or not? She's a shapeshifter. She can make them however big she wants. She could just become one giant boob. <laughs> you know, no, never mind. Or she can have quad boobs. She should try that sometime. This is it, then. This is what you were after. Yes, it is indeed. Do you think they were hiding it here all along? Oh no, did you just introduce another crazy artifact? Come on. I am unable to enter this temple, so you've done me a great service. Wait, what? Then how are you here? Is she outside a temple? If you have what you want- wait, huh? If you have what you want, I'll be leaving. So I guess the deal was, I break you out of prison and you get me this thingy. Now, now, don't be so impatient. You don't want to leave just yet. Do you know what exactly it was that you laid claim to in the Emblem Blood te Temple? You know, Emblem has been around for a long time. Why are they just introducing this now? I hope I'm wrong here and they did introduce this like three books ago or something, but I don't remember Emblem Blood Temple. Also, I like blood. I don't care. Wait, no. This design is familiar. It looks like the tool Asgar Summoner carries. Asgar Summoner. Guess that's us now. Yes, that's right. This is the Summoner's divine weapon. Redoblick. Or a fake, anyway. Wait, what? You. <laughs> did, did you actually come all the way here for a fake Redoblick? There is only one of those in this world, and it's held by Asgar. Then why did we come here? Wait, why did you come? We. You know, I really want to play a farm game where I'm the villain. I better complete three houses soon. Black Eagles forever. This, however, is a mere trinket pieced together by a pathetic sage lusting after the power of the gods. Oh, uh, Sage, did you say? I caught wind of the little scheme of Eatrees and went to take the weapon for myself. Unfortunately, I was found out too. Is Eatree that good? Loki's pretty convincing. And that's when it was hidden away in a temple warded against my entry. You see, and... What? So that means Eatree stopped Loki from stealing fake Bredoblek, and then she broke into Embla, Blood Temple, dropped it off there, and disappeared? All without getting caught. That's a plot. Uh, ahem. Are you even listening to what I'm saying? I'm trying to. The sage created a copy of the summoner's divine weapon? No, it can't be. But if that's true then, then that man from my memory, from when I arrived. That's your brother. Alphonse is your brother. Please tell me I'm right. <laughs> tell me who he is, Loki. To be perfectly honest, to be perfectly honestly, that's, th that, that's an error, right? I, I don't know. I haven't the faintest idea what you're talking about. Some man. Is there another character that they have introduced? It's eight months in, come on, you can't be introducing characters this late. Don't play innocent with me. Uh, I think she always plays constantly guilty. <laughs> Even after all that, I still have no answers for you. I simply do not know what you're talking about. Isn't there someone else you could ask? Someone who might actually have the answers you seek? Well, Loki, if Loki doesn't know, then I wouldn't trust anyone else not to know. Loki seems to know everything. I wonder. Urgh. Brother, there you are, and and who is this? Odor, it's time you learned that your brother is in fact not interested in you. 
And he, like many men, enjoyed the big boobas. I'm sorry. Never mind. We're leaving. But, but brother, what about Embla? I don't know anymore. So they did all this. They attacked. Okay. So Loki broke Fafner out of jail. In re in return, he had to help her find fake Bredoblick and Embla. How did fake Bredoblick get to Embla? Fake Bre Bredoblick was made by Itri, and she hid it in Embla. And that's why there's a, a, a plot. It doesn't matter. I have businesses with Itri. She will tell me what I want to know. They always do. Eventually. I think... I think Itri's the true mastermind here, but like... What kind of plan is it to like... I don't know. This doesn't make sense anymore. I, why Itri? Wait, brother. What happened? I don't know anymore. I... I don't know anything anymore. <laughs> Things seem to be going according to plan. Ah, it was fake. Ah... Uh... Uh, so did Lo did Loki steal fake Bredoblix plan and Embla free Fafner have Fafner I should just keep reading uh, I suppose since this fake is no longer of any use to anyone I don't destroy it well I, I thought it I thought fake Bredoblix was still a good weapon we fought Itri and like fake summoners what Oh, Nevalier, of your Sion yarn, you try to fly a little too high. You sought to imitate Asgard, to add their power to your own. But such power would be too much for any one realm. That is not part of Alphar's design. Alphar is the Great Father, right? So, I guess Loki is serving the Great Father. I think that's like the conclusion of the story. We fight literally the God of Gods. Nah, 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 nah. Wait, that wasn't even the last part? Oh my God, there's more. The choice is clear. Nah, 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 nah. This is why the music stopped. Henri won his battle all alone. I, on the other hand, rely on the strength of my friends. There's nothing wrong with that. I wonder. This way? This way? Here we go. 33 damage. You can't stop me. Yeah, it's still like a giant bonfire at the end of the day. Even if she has damage reduction, it still hurts. I must be Frig, I can't kill Marth, can I? Ugh. Ah. Uh. Tread carefully. I actually have no idea how we're supposed to kill Marth. This way? I smell sweets. Let's take that accidentally while we're at it. Na 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 na. The choice is clear. I can still move well at least. Fuck! I forgot! Even Tempest, damn it! That's right, even Tempest. For a moment, I thought he was going to do the same thing as Sigurd and just give everybody extra movement. That would be too ridiculous. Na, 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 na. 53 speed! I smell sweet! I wonder. Okay, first of all, I need my own tactical nukes up. So I must fight. Uh, can I match him? Oh, I guess we'll see. Come at me. Oh God, he, he's so fast. For the hope of all. I'm sorry. I like how he says for the hope of all as he yeets his younger self. That is kind of depressing. Okay, well. He's really friggin' fast. Did you guys know that? I must be careful. He's really friggin' fast. Forward. 
I smell sweets. Nice. I'll do what I, can. I need hero's blood. Or this isn't going to go well. The choice is clear. A game attack. How do I not have enough speed? How the fuck? This way? Can I get out of the way? Gatekeeper is so slow that even Zane doubles. I don't know, man. This way? Brig. I smell sweet. This is not easy. Boo. I wonder. Nope. Sapphire slants doesn't do shit. Marth hits way too hard. Oh, yeah, that doesn't work. Nothing works. For Altea. I would really wish you said for Altea. This way? Oh my god. Forward. The frig I'm supposed to do about this? I smell sweet. I can't. How can you guys shit talk him? He's so good. All right, you have no friends now. You have no friends. You can't say for your friends when you are all, all your friends are dead. Boom. I need to tank one shot. No, I have close save. Oh crap, I have close save. No. Oh no. Close save. No. Oh wait, zero times two. Bitch. You can't stop me. You can't stop Edo Guard. The greatest. Yeah. Woo. All part of my plan. I'm a tactical genius. Now their troops are withdrawing. Something happened. I don't know. They're really bad at this conquering thing. Phew. They're incredibly strong. We made it through thanks in part to your help. For that, I thank you. He's gone? No. I still have so many questions. Well, if you answered them, they would probably save us two chapters, so... Yeah, it's not happening. It's no use, Princess Regan. We can't follow them. <laughs> Why not? We seem to have caught up pretty easily. Br brother Princess Regan, are you alright? She's burning up. The shock of what's happening must be setting in. I mean, she was always hot. <laughs> Is there a place we can take her where she can rest, Princess Veronica? You may bring her along just this once, as a token of my appreciation. See, Veronica's a good girl. She has appreciation. Uh, whatever happened to her wanting to kill everybody, that never got solved. Then don't anyone dare tell me that got solved. That was not a plot device that got solved. She got beat and she kind of mellowed out. Thank you, Princess Veronica. Fall back, everyone. Wait, why are we falling back? Oh, I guess we're not chasing. We need only hold out a little- What? They, they're retreating, though. We all need only to hold out a little longer. Brother, wait. Fafner. Show yourself, Eitri. I'll level this whole sanctum. Ah, oh, no! That's her- Why? Fafner, I know I should talk to you, but, like... Sangi's sanctum hasn't even been established yet. How could you? I'll level this whole sanctum of yours with you, in it if I have to. Ah, King Fafner, what lovely timing. I have some matters I'd like to address with you as well. Your affairs don't matter to me. Tell me what you know. What I know? You'll have to be more specific. Don't play the fool. The false divine weapon you made. The imitation summoning tool. Who used it? Didn't our clones use it? He. 
He summoned me here to this world, didn't he? What, 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 what? We made Fafner? What the fuck? Why would I summon Fafner? Why would I not summon, like, Surtur? Or another Regan? Have evil Regan. I'm, I kind of want to see evil Regan. Oh my god! Mother, what are you saying? Where is this coming from? Well, this is as bad as the fanfic that was writing that Fafner was Alphonse's long lost brother and at birth Henriette never knew what happened to Alphonse's twin. And they kind of look alike, you know. I'll admit, I'm surprised you were able to get that far by yourself. Rather impressive, actually. Itri, if you... Of those summoned here before you, you have been the only one to maintain any semblance of sanity. Are you saying like all the heroes we've summoned are going to go crazy? Again, truly impressive. I would go so far as to say praiseworthy even. Oh, or she means by the fake Bredoblick. Oh. So the fake Bredoblick summons fake heroes and they all go crazy. Or maybe. Oh. Chat, if you think about it. The fake Bredoblick probably summons heroes from the fake Fire Emblem games. You know those knockout Fire Emblem Heroes games? Everything makes sense now if you think about it! Fafner is from a fake Fey game. That's why he's so shitty as a villain. Damn. Alas, you did lose your memories. So ultimately, just another in a string of failures. I won't be your puppet any longer. I will strangle you with whatever strings you've bound me with. Oh, you shouldn't say that. She's going to beat your ass. Where did I come from? Answer me. Uh, let me look it up. Guys, this is the world of Fafner. He's from this game. Now everything makes sense. He's from a Fey ripoff. That's why he's kind of lame. Huh. I guess that's a pretty nice twist. I like that. I, I approve. I approve. Where did I come from? Answer me. Send me back. Send me back where I belong. I don't think you want to go back. Those are pretty shitty games. They're probably dead by now. Brother, no. Don't say that. Odor always knew. How the heck does Odor know so much? Why is he so supportive if you know so much? I understand now. What I've been searching for all this time. It was on the other side of that summoning gate in Ascar. It's, it's why I, I only wanted to go back. All this time, all this time, I wanted to go home. Oh, do you really mean that? You're likely to hurt Odor's feelings. He's your Oni-chan after all. Wait, Oni-san? I don't know, I'm not a weeb. And after he's made so many sacrifices to keep you here. He even helped create a weapon to destroy gates, all to make sure you can never return. <gasps> Odor is a piece of shit. I knew it. <sighs> After he hurt my giant, beautiful, giant princess. Should have known that. What? Odor. You. Yeah. You can't leave, brother. Without you. What am I? What will I become? I mean... You're already dark PM1, so it's a pretty good fallback plan. <laughs> what is... What is... Is that grammar? It had to end at some point, Fafner. Perhaps the time has come. Oh, and I will answer your question before I erase you. Why do villains do that? They tell you before, like, they, like, they kill you, or they erase your memories, or... They cut off your pee-pee. The answer is something you will find compelling. That man. The one who summoned you. It was me. Oh, see, I knew it. It was the fake bread of Yeah. What? Hell, I'll do. Explain yourself. Who are you? He's just some evil lolly. There are a lot of those in anime. Someone who loves Nivellier more than you can imagine.
in the eight months of this book, I have never once thought Eitri cared about Nevelier. If you love Nevelier more than I can imagine, why did you not show it at all? Why are you an outcast? I don't know. Whatever. This is weird. The zeal that beat in the heart of the realm died of the royal bloodline. And yet... But I thought Regan was part of the world. Oh, I don't know. It seems our god has not yet abandoned us. Okay. <sighs> now, Fafner, you will become an offering on the altar of Nevelier's next king. Gah! The crown. What is it about this crown? What the Verger curse is... No. No, 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 no. Stop. I don't. I don't want to fight anymore. I don't want to... You seem like you're the most happy when you get to kill people. That's why you keep fighting all the time. Okay. Sure. Oh. Yeah. Wah. I, I, I give up, guys. This, uh, I don't even know what the writing is anymore. It's a good twist. But, like... You know, the twists are good when you have, like, some indications and some hints towards it. Now, it is hinted he's not of actual Nevelier bloodline. He's not actually royal, as they literally said before. But isn't this a bit too weird? I don't know. It doesn't even feel... So, he's not even the villain. Is it kind of Itri? Itri says she loves Nevelier, but I've never even felt that. I don't know, man. Maybe I'm stupid. I'm definitely stupid. There you go. That's your answer to everything. I hope you guys enjoyed. That's your chapter. Oh, boy. You guys let me know how you guys feel, I guess. I don't know anymore. Thank you.